Okay, here we are at Turtle Creek Mall in Hattiesburg, and I've got Raymond with me, and uh, JW, and his son Ian. We're going out to pray for the sick and bring the gospel to some people, and uh, Jesus is going to do some amazing things today. And uh, so, here we go. To be continued. Melissa, yes. And you got pain in your shoulder? Yes. Let me ask you this. On a scale of 10 to 1, 10 being the highest pain in the universe? We're about a 6. Right? It's about a 6 right now. Okay. All right. I'm just going to pray for you real quick. Go ahead. Father, I just thank you so much for Miss Melissa. Father, we thank you for your Holy Spirit. Father, I just ask right now to just touch her. We just command all pain in the shoulder to be gone in Jesus' name. In the name of all, in the name of the Holy, we thank you. In Jesus' name, all pain goes. Move it around. Should we go? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Move, move your shoulder around. Oh my God, you're so <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, thank you so much. <laughs> 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 you don't know how bad it's been hurting. Is that amazing or what? Hey, Jesus loves you, so. It's the Holy Spirit. He leads yeah. us, so He yeah. wanted, wanted you healed. You know, He called us to go and heal the sick, cast out demons, cleanse the lepers. His calling is the same today as it's always been. Oh. Thank y'all so much. I'll give you a hug too. Sir, I, love you so much. I love hugs. Definitely. What What happened to your shoulder originally? I got hurt at work. Okay. So is it completely gone now? It was. It's gone. It. Uh, do you move? The bone was inside. I couldn't do that earlier. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, That's do it amazing. Yeah. Thank awesome. Y'all so awesome. Much. Cool. So yeah. And I'll keep y'all in my prayers. Thank you. Yeah, we do. <laughs> hey, give her a, a movie card. Do you have one on you? I don't want to change your life. Do you have one on you? Yeah. So, I just wanted to say that uh, the Jews asked Jesus one time, um, by what authority are you doing the things that you do? Show us the sign that you have the authority to do all these things. And Jesus said, destroy this temple and in three days I will raise it up talking about the resurrection of his physical body and so what he's saying is his resurrection is the ultimate sign of his authority that he is the most high authority in the universe he is the highest authority in the entire universe and he can do whatever he wants whenever he wants and uh, it's because of Jesus's resurrection you see these things happening you see people getting healed because he still does the same things today that he did before they killed him because he's still alive and uh, Paul said if Christ is not raised from the dead I'm a liar and a false prophet and we're all dead in our sins but he said but Christ has been raised from the dead and then he spent his entire life proving it and so in fact if Christ wasn't raised from the dead we wouldn't be doing this video because we would probably be in a bar room somewhere or maybe dead even but uh, Jesus saved all of us and radically changed our lives. And um, if you don't know him, he wants to give you a brand new life too. What's the plan now? Is it one? Zero? I'm not happy for finishing the work and stuff, but I know it's just not. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Move your jaw around some. It's not, it's not hurting the same way it was hurting when I pressed it. But is it pressure or you still feel pain? I still feel pain when I, when I, when I, when I, when I, when I put my jaws down. Mm -hmm. Is it a toothache or what? I'm going to ask that you come and fill with your Holy Spirit right now. Do you just touch his soul and feel his mind? I speak prosperity and truth into his life. In 
Jesus' name, I ask that Holy Spirit, I ask that you come and fill up his mouth right now and all pain leave. I command all pain to leave in the name of Jesus. And you pray, you look for people, and you pray in the power and authority of the Holy Spirit, you love them. Jesus said the two greatest commandments is to love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, and mind, and love your neighbor as yourself. And part of loving our neighbor is having the boldness and the want to to go out and, and love people, pray for them, to share the gospel with them, to heal the sick, cast out demons, to do those things. Every, every believer can do that. And our identity is actually in Christ. So the reason we have the authority is because we're, we're called as ambassadors to Christ, right. which is Christ's kingdom. The kingdom of heaven is an actual place. Did it stop hurting? Yeah. It don't hurt no more? Uh, That's pretty cool, isn't it? What is it now? A one. Zero? Yeah, zero. Yeah. I swear. <laughs> how, did, how do you think that happened? Yeah. It has nothing to do with us. It's Jesus. We, we follow Jesus. You know. He was raised from the dead. So he still does the same things he did before he killed him. He still deals with the same thing. He stays deep. Have you ever understood the gospel? That's the only thing. Oh. Wow. Oh. Bit, but here one more time. Thank you, Father, for continuing to right now in the Spirit, for restoring this man to him. All things will be gone and say with Thurman and Holy Spirit. Believe God and direct us. Show me show your heart, Christ, in his name. Did you feel like yeah, I feel. I feel something. Yeah. How's the thumb feel? Feel better than me. Was that for real or what? Yes. Cause man, I'm, I've been kissing, man. At work, man. What you do for living, man? I'm, I work in a body shop. Okay. Yeah. So you have to use Yeah, right, right, yeah. right. You know, I got awful positions and you know, kind of hard. So is it all gone now? Yeah, man. I feel better, man. Cool. That's um, that's Jesus, man. Yeah. We just we follow Jesus, and He's the healer, dude. You know. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Have, have you guys ever understood the gospel or anything? Uh, not really. Not really. To a little. Push your pain in.
What you do? <laughs> Jesus, man. Yeah. No, really, I'm not being so. No, we're serious. It's we really, we really feel good. It's not us. We, we just call him Jesus. He's the healer. Because he's raised from the dead. He died for us and he was raised from the dead. And now, the proof that he's alive is that he still does the same thing as he did before they killed him. He still heals the sick. And he still forgives people of their sins. Like this happened to me. Did it go away? Yes, it did. Really? Yeah, I feel better. I can go all the way back now. Huh? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, man. Appreciate it. Thank you, man. Come here, one All right, so here we are back again with the end of our night. Uh, it's been a really awesome day. We got some stuff on film, some stuff we didn't. Uh, you know, the only way that you'll ever see the things you saw today is to go out and do it. Uh, we are nothing more than just disciples of Christ. Um, Jesus said to go out and, and that if we would do, to do the same things that he did. And that's all we're doing is just being obedient to that, which no special gifting. Nothing like that. It's just simply going and doing. Yeah. And so we want to encourage you that you can do the exact same thing. If you're born again, if you've been filled with the Holy Spirit, you can go out and do the same thing. It says these signs yeah. will believe those that these signs will follow those that believe. Yeah. And so uh, that's all we're doing. So God bless you. And Hope you enjoy the video. It's all about bringing that. It's not just about healing. God that's likes right. to heal people because He loves them and He's a healer. But it's about bringing the gospel to people so that's right everybody that we prayed for that got healed was open to sit and listen to the gospel that's right otherwise yeah. they would not have listened to it you know that's right so, so it's been an awesome night with these guys it's been a been, been really awesome and to quote peter almond he says uh, the more you go and do the more you're going to see just that simple yeah. so to be continued